<laughs> I wasn't watching, but I guess it didn't go well. Yeah, so, uh, we kind of have... I want to go back and rewatch that, uh, triple bear, except I'm going to edit the clip so I recover the stage. <laughs> what I'm going to do is I'm going to do it in, like, MS Paint, right? Where, like, it's just a, yeah, a just, wolf JPEG. Just, like, moving to the yeah. ledge, and then, like, have the grab animation. Donk. Donk. He's dead. He's dead. Oh, he's not dead. Yeah, no. It's it's only against me where he hits those, you know. Oh yeah, you're playing Ridley, bro. Yeah. I hate to break it to you. Your character's a pinata. True. An actual XP pinata. So I I really like it when, uh, or at least I don't know if I like it, but like it when TJ just starts Ivy in this matchup. Like, uh, what is the reason? Like, I don't know why you would ever play Squirtle unless you're like that confident you're that much better. But like. Ivy just makes your life easier in this matchup. He's dead. Ha! Can you plug the, the brown cable all the way in? There we go. We're back. Hey. Sorry, we had a, a little bit of an incident there. The unplugging incident. As it turns out, it's completely even. Boosh, boosh. Steve is funny. He's just not as funny as Kazuya, so I think they're both very problematic characters. I watched a video today, uh, Larry, Larry Lur talking about the uh, worst designed Smash Ultimate characters, and he had Steve Kazuya uh, uh, two and one, respectively, and I... Thank God. I mean, he's, he's right. He is spitting. But I give Kazuya the pass just because he's funny. Steve yeah. isn't that funny. At, at least at least with Kazuya, it's just like, don't go to FD, you know? Yeah. Steve can just go anywhere and then do anything. Yep. Funny story, actually, about Steve or about uh, Kazuya on FD. I uh, was at a tournament this weekend, and uh, the RBA Smash, shout out to Madison Turner. Uh, it was actually a really fun tournament. Um, but I played a, a Kazuya, and it went game three, and I had counter pick, and so I banned Smashville and FD because even though I played Greninja, I don't want to play against Kazuya on FD. And then I got haha funny when the Kazuya player took me to Kalos, which I completely forgot is like on the regular Maryland rule set, but it's not on the incredibly based Southern Maryland rule set. Man, I'm so pissed that no one likes Lilac. Yeah, I'm really glad that I don't have to play against Ridley on Lilat. I mean, you, you never you never had to play it. No, I, I told you, I, the one time I played against Smub was in friendlies, and he took me to Lilat, and he planked on me for seven minutes. I love Lilat. No way he lives. He lives. <laughs> he like mega lives, by the way. He, he was going like, at least to he the al middle He almost recovered on all of that shit. Field, right. He's dead though. Shout out to both these characters. Yeah, both these characters are evil. Both of them are very fun to play against, I must say. Mm, I think uh, I'm detecting a little bit of sarcasm. Maybe just a little. Yeah. You know, like 1%. Here's the thing, though. I feel like Ridley can have fun against any character. Like He can. It's just that when the other player... It's harder for him to obtain the fun. When the other player uh, denies the fun... Yeah. You just kind of have to hold Because so, like, Ridley can always have fun on his turn. Pokemon just against some characters, he never really gets to take his turn. True. Yeah. One of which being today. Yeah. I never got a turn. <laughs> Three, two, one, Lost two interactions go! by stock. Lost one interaction by stock. Sometimes Ridley does that stuff. Yeah. I think it would have been funny if Steve died there. On Ridley, he would have died. You know? I don't know. Ivysaur? You definitely would have gotten hit by it. I don't think it would have killed you. I don't know, man. I died at 40, yes. Or last That's week. true. Against, you did die. Uh, against Jacob, I yeah. died at 40. Yeah, so. but those are Jacob's Ivysaur out there. They, they actually have more knockback than uh, TJ's yeah. Ivysaur out there. Yeah, TJ only gets his buff on like F Smash and then Player Woods. No, and Bullet Seed. Oh yeah, and Bullet Seed. And Waterfall. And waterfall. <laughs> all of the, all of the, the stupid I, 
I swear, playing against these two players in particular, it's... Playing against uh, Cal takes years off my life, and playing against TJ makes me actively stupider. Yeah, I, I agree. Because I, I, I had to play TJ, and he just threw out every single move in the book, and I was like... Yeah. Yep. I mean, if you're not pressing a button, you can't deal damage to the other player. You True. Know? That's a, that's the and then against Cal, it's, the, it's kind of similar, but like for all the different reasons. Like all the wrong reasons. Yeah, all the wrong reasons. F smash. See, I, you know, like, with a lot of players, when I'm watching, I'm like, oh, I, I like, it's, like, fun to try to guess, like, what they're going to do. Like, with Goofy, I, I, like, I like to guess what he's going to do to see if we're, like, kind of thinking on the same wavelength as Greninja players. Um, but then it, then I uh, watch TJ play, and TJ, uh, you can never guess I'm just wrong every do. time. Uh, unless unless it's, like, him off stage, then you can guess, yeah, Flare Blitz, you know? He just tried to kill him twice at 46, and he's going to make it back to stage. Yep. Remember, you're never not an advantage state with PT. It's an important thing to keep in mind. I watched Justin Violet come. That was. I remember uh, I, at Stick Drift this weekend, I watched Justin Violet comprehensively outplay Pub A for uh, two whole games. And uh, he had a three stock lead and then. Uh, he died twice in the span of like a minute. Yeah. Uh, one of them being at 30. Yep. Because, uh... Also, shout out to the Xenoblade music in the background. Yeah, that's like the one, right, the one, uh, bright part. There are some songs that I just really wish were in Smash that aren't. Like, I think, uh... Yeah, like, Gets His Theme from Black and White 2. Who's the uh, Pokemon, the the evil guy from uh, Black and White, the guy with like the red. Gonna be honest, I never played Black and White. Evil. But like, uh, I saw a mod that put Blooming Villain from Persona in. Oh yeah, you should just you should die in there. I agree. No, he should be able to run off and do three of them. I think that's awesome and swag. Um, Blooming Villain from Persona Five. I, I'm like actually very sad now that I've played through Persona, almost all of it. I'm really sad that song isn't in Smash. Also, yeah. like our beginning, or is it, yeah, our beginning, the one from like the very end of the game, amazing. I wish that were in here. Um, for some reason, we get like 58 King of Fighters songs and we get like nine Personas. <laughs> Look, Joker was first. They were learning. I guess. But, like, Persona 5 probably has the best music of any game I've ever played in my entire life. And just the fact that we don't get more of it makes me a little sad. Also, Ivy Pivot Grab is evil. So is Greninja Pivot Grab, but yeah. nobody nobody talks but about it. At, at least Greninja doesn't just down throw you up air, up air. Yeah. People would talk about it if Greninja had... Uh, Combos or kills off, he just throws it like yeah. reasonable percents. But Dude, if they give Greninja like an actual combo throw on like every character, I would win Super Majors. Sure. In the world if Ridley had See, he doesn't drop those there. against me. Yeah, he also doesn't drop those against me. I may be a bit biased, but he was on Zard, so. Yeah, I was gonna say Zart's pretty big, but uh, he just—he hit that same upset against me multiple times in our set, and uh, I died like every and, time. I—I uh, I went to 70 every time he hit me. By the way, <laughs> anytime well, you deserve it for playing Ridley. I was playing Wolf. No, I don't think I deserve it. Anyways, it's looking like a quick 30 and a handshake. Looks like I'm gonna get home in time to to eat Applebee's. Oh, true. We might. Uh, he's dead. Yeah, why not play Blitz out of the corner at 90? You know, you do just lose your stock if it doesn't oh, work, it's a, but... It's 11, maybe not. Let's see. This is Cal's tournament stock. You know he wants sexy Kirby. Alright, we're playing Tetris. And uh, I guess Charizard just goes through that. Yeah, Yeah. I also guess Charizard lives point blank minecart at 160. What's the shoutouts to, to... I swear... When me and Cal first played, every time he did that block setup, it I would beat you. it. And, oh, then, now, and now, now, now it just kills you. Now it just kills me. I, I don't know what happened. 
I don't know if Steve got like shadow buffed or something. Like, uh, if I somebody data mines this game and finds out that Steve got shadow buffed, I'm gonna do something that's gonna put me in prison for life. <laughs> Same here. <laughs> Same here. Night, I'm not one to advocate violence over a video game, but, but like, come on. But I will be buying plane tickets to Japan, and there will be weapons in my luggage. He's dead. All right, that's gonna do it for Mega Drive, uh, Mega Drive number 101. Uh, I sure do love these two characters. They definitely play the same game that everybody else plays. Yep. Have a nice night, everyone.